I think we're going. Okay. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. As you can tell, we're doing uh, uh, some cooking. I got all the ingredients here. I, I didn't grab everything, obviously, but I'm gonna start making some food. Uh, today is Omi Rice, which Animal Crossing had it in there. That's why I decided to just do this today. Uh, it was a pain setting everything up. I don't even know if I have all the ingredients yet. I found a recipe of this on uh, some website, I don't know. It's a pain. Uh, so many ads, bro. And I feel like they do that on purpose so they can get the money. But we're gonna get started here soon. first. I'm thinking of using a cookie sheet. I got some pre-made rice here. Uh, it's what the recipe calls for, but I needed like one three-fourths, uh, which is a serving considered in the recipe. I'm gonna double the recipe mostly. So we're gonna need <laughs> a lot of rice. <laughs> Hopefully I made enough. I think I did, but I'm not completely sure. I didn't season the rice at all. Because I was kind of hoping that everything in this recipe would actually season it. First thing that they want you to do, basically. Here, here's the rice cooker. I don't know if you could see it exactly, but yeah, the first thing they want you to do is kind of like cook it off right away so you can have it cool. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just kind of like guessing what I'm doing here because I have no clue. But this is going to be the first stream that I, I think I did this week for food and whatnot. So we've done one before, but I don't think it's ever been on YouTube. I think I've always done it off YouTube and whatnot. So straight up, cook and stream today. Let's see, I wanna make sure that I have enough. What, what I'm doing right now is I'm putting this on a baking sheet to kind of cool it off. Cause I think I'm making a fried rice essentially. Let's see. Almost two cups. That looks about right. Ah, no! Not on the tablet. Oh, God. The rice got everywhere. Okay, that looks about right. <laughs> I actually was not expecting it to go everywhere. No, what am I doing? I know it's hot, but I gotta, gotta do this easier. I think I made enough for about three cups of rice. I think that's exactly what I might need, too. Oh, it looks like I got exactly what I would need. Oh yeah, that's exactly what I need. I'm glad that I made enough. <laughs> I was actually worried at first that I wasn't going to make enough. That was like the first thought in my head. It's like, I'm not going to make enough rice. There we go. Now I got the uh, rice. They want you to cool it off for a bit, so. It's quite a lot of rice. It said Japanese rice, but I don't I just use white rice, like, <laughs> what do you, what, what, why is it, what's the difference? I don't, I don't know. I'm not exactly, uh, uh snabby and, like, cooking and stuff like that, so. I got that more, like, cooling off or whatnot right now. But, uh, let me see, hold up. There we go. Alright, I got those cooling off, that's okay with me. Let's see if I have to cut anything else on here. I think I might have to do some uh, garlic. Let's see. Mince onion, then diced chicken, heat oil. All right, I'm pretty much close. I'm pretty much close. All I gotta do is uh, mince the onion. That's crazy, mince it? I've never minced an onion before, so let's see how this goes. Yeah, the, the recipe asks for like half of an onion, but since I'm doubling everything, I'm doing like two. By the way, there's a way that you can cut onions that don't burn your eyes, but I don't know how to do it very well, so I'm not going to do it. I'm just going to cut them how I feel works out. So let me peel this off real quick. There we go. Awesome. Ah. I don't like this side. I'm gonna use this side. 
mincing, man. How do you mince an onion? I've seen someone... Oh. I missed that. I've seen somebody wear goggles when they chop onions. I guess I could, but I don't really have goggles with me right now. I wonder how I'm supposed to... I don't know. I'm gonna julienne them and then maybe do it from there, go from there. Because I don't know exactly how it wants me to do it. So I'm just gonna take guesses here. So if I'm mincing them, does it want me to go like super thin? Then. Ooh. Ah, no. That looks right. That looks about. I mean, they look more dice than anything, but. To be fair, it doesn't really say whether or not it wants it to be diced or... It just says minced. I never minced onions before. Maybe I'll keep chopping it after I'm done with this, too. Once I'm done with this half, at least. Then we'll go from there. Because I, I don't know. Alright, guys. One sec. Chat is really weird on the, the mobile devices, because I'm streaming from mobile, so... It's a whole different feel. Okay. It's hard to chop everything when you're sitting. Let's go from here. Probably not the best cutting method, but yeah. Oops. It's already starting to burn. <laughs> I hate onions, man. I hate them so much. They're so good, but they burn so much. Ah, they're starting. That's why I wanted to sit below, because at least ah, didn't burn as much right away. It's starting to burn already. <laughs> okay. That's a start. I also got some chicken, too. We're doing chicken thighs, because I, I don't know exactly what kind it wants me to do in this one, but uh, I'm going to test them all out and see how they go. So far, it's looking pretty good. Ah, man, my eyes. Gotta grab a bowl. I don't even know if I have any bowls left. We, we ate cereal this morning, so we don't have a lot of bowls to begin with. If I got something small, I could take that. Uh, I'm gonna just give it a little bit more chops. Because it says mince. I'm not completely sure exactly what it wants me to do with mincing. But, or how small it says, three millimeters, but I'm not gonna be here measuring. That's just the, not what I wanna do. God, it's so freaking burning. Burns your eyes like crazy. <laughs> I got a small uh, cutting board for this. Let me grab a cup. Make that one open. Uh, I don't think I need something big, so we're gonna use that. I'm gonna chop this in half. So I have an easier time mincing them. There we go. That looks a lot better. They're starting to look more minced. A lot more minced than diced. Because <laughs> they started looking diced at first. I'm like sending all these freaking pieces everywhere. It's okay. Burn your eyes, man. This is gonna be like the first stream where I start crying on stream instead of post off. Holy crap, man. That is freaking crazy. I hope I could do the whole onion. <laughs> God. I feel like this is gonna take a lot longer now because insane burns. I wish I would learn. I wish I would have learned how to do it without burning your eyes open. Omirice is supposed to take not that long though, so... I'm just assuming that because I'm making so much... My, I gotta get a big pot too. Like a big pan or something. Otherwise this is gonna burn the heck out of it. Or it's not gonna fit. Because there's a lot of onions alone. So we're working off of just a lot of onions. I don't normally do anything other than gaming, but, you know, sometimes you need a break. I'm going to be streaming Splatoon later on, too, so don't worry. 
Um, I'm also still doing that, but I thought I would cook some food while I'm at it. Because it's better than ordering. We've been ordering for the past four days. So I don't know if you guys have, but there's a show called Bean Puppy Cat. We just finished it up. It's pretty good, honestly. It's a good show. Uh, it's a lot more than what they did when they put it on YouTube initially. Holy crap, man. Yo, what's up, Cadence? Welcome to the stream. How's it going? Whew, burning my eyes are crazy. Got, we got some cooking going, making some omu, um, omu rice, I think that's how you say it. I'm not exactly sure on how you pronounce it, but holy crap, man. Burning my eyes raw. <laughs> I think this bowl was like a perfect size for the onions. Like, look at that. I don't know if you can see it perfectly because of the lighting, but woo! Oh my god. I feel like it got so much worse. Why did it get worse? It's going good. I'm also cooking. What are you cooking? What's the food plan? Right now we're doing only rice. Oh man, only Reese. I don't even remember. I forgot honestly. Okay, we're gonna cut this in half, and we're gonna worry about that one afterwards. Otherwise, it just becomes a clogged mess up on the cutting board. There we go. Mince. Even smaller. There we go. All right. We're gonna get like a nice. Julianne again. I feel like it worked a little bit. Okay. I love how they use, like, in, like, songs like this, I love how they use uh, Legend of Zelda, like, uh, uh, Ocarina of Time, like, Navi saying, hey, it's genius. It's also nostalgic. There we go. Give that a little bit more of a chop too. Mincing, mincing. I should have looked up how to mince onions a little better. Figured out a good strategy on how to do it. To be honest, I was just trying to stream. And then this freaking tablet is slow. How's your day? My day's going good. I'm making chicken breast roast. It wouldn't let me say breast without the comma. Yeah, YouTube. YouTube's like, what are you saying, bro? Chicken breast is good. It's healthier. I'm making I'm making uh, this with chicken thighs, so it's pretty. It's gonna be pretty good. I like thighs opposed to breast because breasts usually turn out dry. There's a way that you can make it not dry. I don't think I'm as an exper as of an experienced uh, cook yet to be able to do it. Right? Thighs are a lot easier because they're fattier. So, oh, holy crap, those onions, man. YouTube over here thinking I'm sus, man. For real. So Tesh, you only got don't watch on an empty stomach, learn the hard way. <laughs> uh, even cooking on an empty stomach is hard. Because then you're like, I want to try everything. And then you end up trying something. It's not as good as you were hoping because it's not ready yet. <laughs> but agreed, I agree. Work, work, what's up, man? Welcome. We do other things, you know? We're not only uh, uh, streaming games. Not really. This is like the first cooking stream I have in a while. We're going to have a special stream tomorrow, too, along with just what's happening today. Hopefully. We'll see how it goes with everything. Sorry, guys. Ugh. Just came back from school. How's school, man? I like thighs and post rest. Oh, come on, YouTube. Now you're making... Yeah, for real. YouTube's making it worse. At least YouTube uh, won't... I don't think YouTube will, like, censor thighs, so you should be all right to say that. I don't even think it will censor breasts. I mean, I'd be surprised if they did, honestly. Like, because a lot of cooking channels are on YouTube. Imagine how hard that would be to, like, communicate with chat. They're like, <laughs> breast. Oh, Melody has an easy time. I think it's just you, Cadence. <laughs> did you watch the Nintendo Direct? I did, bro. It was actually pretty interesting. I liked some of the stuff. Like, one of my favorite things was probably the Nintendo 64 stuff. I love Zelda, I'm excited, but they did not give me anything to work on on thinking about what Zelda would be. I love the name though, I love the name. It's because I'm under 18, you could say it if you're over 18. That's a weird, wait, ah, holy crap. That's weird, I've never even heard of that happening before. Them censoring you age-wise. 
interesting though. God, my eyes. <laughs> Straight up burning. Whew. It's probably just a setting you could turn Oh yeah, true. That's probably something too. I think YouTube uh, as an app alone uh, lets you censor words that you, you, you know, I don't know. Yeah, otherwise, uh, God, my eyes, dude. I hate onions. I hate them, but I love them. It's a love-hate relationship. Uh, okay, let's go. I love the music though. I wasn't sure what I would have in the background because last time I did a cooking stream it was really awkward when it was quiet. At least now you got like some music in the background. It would kind of like not be as boring as what it was. For a while I was wondering the first video I watched came from Thunderstorms and Taz video. Oh wait you came from the Animal Crossing stuff. Hey the Thunderstorm one was crazy. That was such a long time ago. I was playing it like constantly, Animal Crossing. That was the memories. Did you watch the rest of the series after that, or were, were, was that it? Like after that? Sorry guys. Oof, I'm a little bit too high, but or too upwards, I guess. I'm not stoned, I promise. If YouTube will let me say that, I don't know. I'm lurking forward uh, to Assassin's Creed Mirage coming out next year. I have never played one. I followed up on some. Oh, nice. Ooh, I want to do more Animal Crossing, but, like, the updates are so dead. Also, Assassin's Creed. I wish I could play Assassin's Creed, but it gets boring to me, honestly. I tried, though. I did try. There was one Assassin's Creed that I liked where they had multiplayer. That was good stuff. I love the multiplayer. Me and my friend used to play a lot. I haven't talked to that friend in a while. I gotta catch up and stuff. But, yeah. <clears throat> I'm probably still gonna play Animal Crossing for strings and stuff like that. I uh, try to get my island back together because it's a mess. It's no longer flowers that makes it a mess, but... Woo! It's just kind of... Ah, oh, man, these freaking still burn, man. Taking such a long time on just the, uh, just the onions, but... It's okay. Ain't no rush. Ain't no rush. I'm not in any rush at all, actually. Wait, Chef Random? Yes, my dude! Cooking stream, heck yeah, Envy. All about cooking. Vibe of the music? Me too, it's so nice. Gordon Ramsay, who? Ain't nothing when it's in my kitchen. <laughs> no, not really. I'm a mess when it comes to cooking. Oh, but I'm trying. I'm trying my best. My eyes are burning. Yo, what's up, Ray? Welcome. I got one more onion. Got one more onion to go, and then I'm done with the eye burning and stuff. <sighs> okay. There we go. Come on. They want you to thinly slice this, like mince it, kind of like garlic. And I'm, <laughs> I've never minced an onion before, so it was a def definitely an interesting take on how you do it. Sorry guys, I keep like missing chat for a second. It's hard to read it when it disappears constantly. Ahmed, welcome. Feed us. Just kidding. Yeah, it, it's a good, it's a good meal. Have you guys seen the thumbnail? That's what I'm making. Uh, I got the idea from Animal Crossing. Honestly, Animal Crossing has some good looking food in it. Alright, onions are done. No moss. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, that freaking, my eyes. My eyes and my nose both. Alright, we got the onions. The onions are all good in a cup. Everything going. Chef Random versus Chef Mario. I'd win. I'd win. 1v1 for sure. Random for sure, yeah. That that's an easy win right there. Feed me? Yo bro, come 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 roll up. Maybe I will. Slice the chicken into one half centimeter pizzas. Okay. So I don't even remember how much chicken I need. Okay, I need one boneless thigh. I'm actually gonna use two. Woo! Chicken is gross, man. There we go. Got two chickens. Sorry guys. I miss chat every freaking second. I wish chat wouldn't disappear. Is there a way? ASMR after? <laughs> ASMR eating video? I don't know. I don't know if I want to do that. <laughs> uh, vegan teacher enters chat. Yo, she don't like this. This ain't the this ain't the stream for her. Definitely not. She ain't gonna like what I'm about to do. <laughs> I'm gonna need a. 
I'm gonna need a plate or something. Something to carry the chicken on. Cool. Got a green plate for chicken thighs and whatnot. It wants me to dice it into half an inch. So let's go like, like there. I don't have the best knife for, for chicken. I mean, it should work, but I did not sharpen it all. Come on, Sham. <laughs> Your kitchen, like Dashy Kitchen? Who's Dashy? Is that like a YouTuber or? My, catch, my kitchen got a, a Hispanic feel to it, for sure. My, my family's feel to it, but it's definitely not my family. It was a different family. Dashy game. Oh yeah, did you? What does this kitchen look like? I'm interested. <laughs> He screams a lot. Oh, that's right. That's right. Watch out. Watch out for what, fam? Ooh. God, it's so hard to do this. Let's chop that one in half real quick. Chicken's really hard because uh, it's so slimy. I probably should have damped it out with a knife or something. Or cut it while it was frozen. That would have been a good idea. I mean, this one was never frozen. At least I don't think it was. When we bought it, it was not frozen. As far as I'm aware, at least. But <laughs> there's some, there you go. We got a little bit of dice there. Vegans, watch out. For real, vegans, this ain't the stream. Yo, I didn't know this was a cooking channel. Yo, it is now, name. This is this is the new uh, channel channel style. We're cooking. We're cooking straight up. Oh, my, Gulliver sees his cousin being shot for real. <laughs> oh, you know what that means? Whenever like they make food in that game, especially the turkey, man. For Thanksgiving, like they gotta have a turkey to dinner, right? How they make food at Animal Crossing. Most of it is fish, though. You'll notice in Animal Crossing that most of the food that you can make is fish. That's that's one thing I noticed. Okay, come on. Stop being so slimy. Alright. There we go. I also got the rice. I don't know if you guys saw earlier, because many of you guys weren't here, but we got some rice cooling off right now on a baking sheet. Thought it was gonna be the best idea to do it. I think I read it on here too. Uh, that that was the best way to cool it off. There we go. Maybe I should do it one at a time. Maybe that'll be the best way to do it like for these chicken pieces. I'll just do it like me. Yeah, one at a time. It'll be a lot faster. Oh, gross. Oh, gross. Chicken is so gross, though, to be honest. I'm gonna have to wash my hands after this. I actually don't like carrying cleaver either. Wait, cleaver? You mean, like, uh, 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 the, the uh, knife? What do you mean cleaver? I don't think you cook with a cleaver. <laughs> Unless you do. That, that'd be kind of interesting, honestly. If you cook with a cleaver, that's pretty cool. That's more of a butcher thing, though, I thought. Oh, man. Ray, I'm gonna have to watch that video. I keep forgetting to watch your video about uh, about like the funny moments. Bro, where did all the villagers go? Where did you get all the supplies for food? Yeah, I, I actually, uh, I'm actually working behind the scenes, um, <laughs> obviously. That's where all the animals from Animal Crossing went. I still got chicken left over that I won't be using, so I'm gonna have to store that for another day. Because I got two, ah, I'm not gonna be able to open this. They tasted great, yeah, they were so good. I mean, the usage of salt and everything? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, rice, let's go! Exactly. Alright, I'm not gonna be using this chicken for quite a while, so straight to the freezer this chicken thigh will go until I use it later on. I don't want it to go bad. Everything goes bad, dude. Everything goes so bad whenever I don't use it for quick enough. Okay. That's one down the drain. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. We had to cook the Animal Crossing villagers. They were tasty. I'll tell you that, though. They were actually really good. Alright. I don't want to get any, like, cross-contamination with chicken thighs and whatnot, so... I'm gonna get rid of some of these dishes on there. Oh, no! I just missed a big chat. I'm sorry. Hold on. I'll, I'll get to it. I'll get to it. Let's see. Alright. Live. Direct was trash, you think so? I don't use a cleaver to cut up tough meat. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't have a cleaver, though, to be honest. <laughs> Understandable. What, what, what didn't you like about the Direct, though? 
I thought it was okay, honestly. Personally, I thought it was okay. I mean, I don't think it was the best direct, for sure, but it definitely wasn't terrible, terrible. I love Zelda, so, you know. Bro, the rice is making me hungry. I love rice. Yo, me too. Uh, that's why I decided this recipe, because rice was one of the things I really liked. No Pikmin 4? Pikmin 4? Yeah, Pikmin 4 was a good choice, too. Dude, they're, they're absolutely, like, showing it off now. I'm excited for that. Pikmin 4 to look like a good game, honestly. Yo, Prodigy, welcome! This is a game. We're about to do some cooking, you know? I don't know if I could show it off exactly, but... You know, I'm here. Welcome. Welcome, Octo Rose. Yo, imagine smelling it. Those onions are make, driving me crazy. Can, can Do you smell like the uh, strength of it? That's crazy. It is strong. All right. Now we get a big old pan or whatever. I don't know exactly the size I'm going to need, so we got this one here. Mmm, <sighs> rice, I know. <laughs> Just wait until all this stuff is going. All right, first thing that's going in, we're gonna preheat the, uh, the thing, put it on medium heat because this thing is psycho. I think I'm actually gonna use olive oil this time. Extra, extra virgin olive oil. I don't know if you could read that exactly, but bam. I don't need a lot of it. This is making me hungry. <laughs> well, good, cause the food's coming. I'm inside Random Square stove, bro. Where, bro? I don't see you. <laughs> Uh, Cook Tom Nook, step two, have a feast. I don't know if Raccoon would be that good, though, to be honest. He might be, though, honestly. The one thing I'm concerned about this recipe, though, is that you don't season the, the, the chicken at all. You just throw the chicken in there. So that's a little concerning. Okay, and then we um, throw this onions. Bam, the onions are the ones that smell so good. I thought it was chickens at first, but it actually isn't, so. I'm just gonna use a good old, good old wooden spoon. I like using the wooden spoon. It makes me feel like I'm more of an authentic chef. I'm not, but you know, I don't know. I, it makes me feel good. Okay, don't judge me. I, I'm trying my best, and my best might not be enough, but it's enough for me. Look at all these, dude. Look at how good this looks. <laughs> I'll bring you a little bit closer. We'll we'll get we'll get like the good view of it. Hold on. Boom. Look at that. Look at how good that looks, man. I'm so excited for the new Zelda. Yes, dude. I'm so excited, too. I'm sad that it comes out that late. I was hoping it'd come out this year, but I'm so hyped, dude. Cooking skills test has started. Oh, no. Oh, no. The good thing, this is satisfying to watch. I'm glad. I'm glad. That's awesome. Um, the, the thing about cooking, right, is, like, you can never go wrong with cooking, I don't think. I think as long as you keep it on, like, a medium heat, or something like like low medium heat you should be okay you should never be able to burn something unless you forget it which I do forget a lot because I have ADHD I walk away one minute and then everything is burning especially with pancakes one time I had a pancake maker or we still have it but like uh, I, I definitely burn the pancakes by leaving them in spoon three is my favorite game yo mine too I can't wait for the Splatfest are you guys excited for the Splatfest I'm telling you, I don't really cook as much as I like to. I only know how to make pasta, macaroni, sweet Chinese chicken, oven baked chicken, and green beans. Hey, yo, what do you mean you don't know how to cook? That's a lot of stuff, man. I'm in your rice. Well, it's a good thing I have my onions here, not rice. <laughs> but what do you mean you don't know how to cook? Hey, look, I think everybody has the, uh, the capacity to be able to cook, okay? It's actually super easy. I never went to college for this, so... I'm a, I'm a pick grub for spot fest. Ooh, good choice, good choice. I think that's what my wife is choosing too. I'm going with gear. And I know that's gonna be like completely different from everybody else's, but I think gear is important. Like say you're stranded on an island, right? Which one would you rather have? Is grub, gear, or, um, or uh, fun? Yeah, fun doesn't make sense for that kind of situation, I don't think. I'm not, I'm not really for it, to be honest. Why gear? Um, the, the reason why I'm choosing gear is because you could use it to get food. Uh, you could use it to, like, make fun in some sort of way, you know? Like, you dig holes, get, like, a coconut, and use it to, like, play, uh, like, uh, what do they call it? Uh, 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 beanbag toss. I'm in the cheddar cheese bag, beat that. Oh, snap, dude. <laughs> you need grub to live? Exactly, but you use tools to catch the grub, you know what I mean? Like, it's not that bad. 
like once you got like a certain amount of uh, tools and skills like you got like say one of your tools or gear is uh considered um uh like a fishing rod you know suddenly everyone is in random's kitchen bro you said you were in my uh my cheddar cheese so where, where at though <laughs> oh no i hope not i'm in your meat i am a meat lover of my family wow look at that though look at how good that looks i mean it doesn't look good raw but like it's gonna be good once it's cooked out i think at least I feel like gear is important, but getting food is really hard in the wilderness. I feel like uh, you could make some mix. Yeah, that's true. That's true. But say, like, how long do you think they'll provide you food, you know? I mean, your oven. <laughs> At least when you got gear, it'll last you a long time. Food, I don't know if they're going to provide you it, like, over, like, a lifetime, you know? If that was the case, why wouldn't they just save you? They gave you gear and stuff like that? That'll at least... Um... Okay, here's here's something, right? Uh, a Bible verse. I'm not really religious, but well, I'm in random eyelashes. Oh no! Uh, you you teach a man to fish, right? Or you give a man a fish. You'll feed him for a day. You teach a man to fish. Uh, he he'll eat for a lifetime or something like that. I don't remember how it goes. Uh, that that's what I think. You need the gear to be able to like survive on your own. The gear breaks ease. Yo, we're not talking Animal Crossing gear. <laughs> Octo be having part two and I have part one. Random eyelashes fall out. Oh no, not in the food. Not in the food. Yeah, Melody's in the other room waiting for the food to be done. I think what I'm waiting for on these uh, onions exactly is for them to kind of go opaque. To go a little bit more clear too. They're starting to look really good though. You can kind of see the smoke coming up. I don't know if you can see it on stream, but I'm excited to see what how it turns out. I'm not the best chef, so, you know, not even a chef. Uh, put juice poop. What? <laughs> yeah, uh, but use the grub to attract animals, then eat. That's fair. I can I could see that. But, like, realistically, wouldn't you want to keep the grub for yourself to survive, you know? Because, like, if you're using it for animals, what's the point of having the grub then, you know? Here's an idea, right? Every place on Earth should have bugs, right? You could use the bugs to, like, catch animals as well. I'm in your knife. I feel like a psycho. Oh, no. Dude, that's the worst place to be, honestly. Plus, what grub could get... Plus, what grub could you get with a shovel and a lantern? Yo, okay, so I don't think that's the only thing they'll give you. I feel like that's just an example, you know? What are your theories about the DLC for Splatoon? I think it's gonna be, like, an Octo expansion number two, you know? Same thing, probably. That That's my only theories I got so far. But like, I think they'll give you like a fishing rod, maybe, maybe, um, maybe a shovel, uh, possibly a hoe. I don't know. Even like rope. I, I feel like they would give you a lot more than what they pictured. They give you, you know. I don't think it was just what they showed. Hold on, let's turn this up a little bit. The opaqueness. What do we got after this? Actually, let me see. Have the chicken cooked till it's no longer pink. Pink. Uh, add mixed vegetables and season with salt and pepper. Okay. Easy. Easy peasy. So I just gotta wait for this to like, uh, 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 uh opaque and then these to actually turn into a chicken. Proud, but other people are theorizing some sort of battle royale. Ooh, that would be cool. That's what I wanted from, uh, from, uh, Splatoon to be honest. But I don't think it's plausible being how laggy it is with just like regular lobby, <laughs> you know? Uh, next recipe, Mushroom Skewer from Breath of the Wild. Oh my god, dude, that would be so good. I wish, I wish. We have one job, y'all. Make sure kitchen doesn't burn down. Yeah, yeah, uh, uh, ring the alarm bells if something ends up burning, you know? <laughs> Let me know. Let your boy random know. Look how good this looks. Oh my god. It smells delicious. I love onions. I bet Splatoon 3 DLC is something about humans since the log is really focused on Ted Lennus. What if, we, what if we find humans? What if that's one of the things? What game is this? It looks real. This is actually Cooking Simulator. Uh, it's kind of wild. It even has like my arms in real life, you know, coming in and cooking and whatnot. That is kind of crazy. The, the UI is insane. Bro, you should have a cooking channel? I thought this would, would be my, my mix, you know, cooking channel and everything. Game is on some IRL quality? I know, for real. This is what happens when you turn RTX on, you know? This is what happens when you have RTX. You get ray tracing and everything looks so realistic. Like, look at these onions, man. Look at them. Look at them. Mmm. Mmm. 
I don't know. They're, they're, they're coming out pretty good. Dude, they look so good, though. I'm, I'm hyped. I'm gonna have to try them out. Uh, yo, is this the DLC? Yeah, this is the Splatoon 3 DLC. As you can see, Breath of the Wild, they're adding, they added cooking. Uh, Animal Crossing, they added cooking, and now Splatoon. Bro, make a prequel video to this? <laughs> I don't even know what kind of prequel we would be able to do for this. Uh, maybe me going and buying the, the stuff? I see myself not cooking. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's not you, it's actually somebody else. That's the best part about it, you know? I like watching people cook. Sometimes I hate cooking, though. But I love cooking after when I get to try the food. Like right now, boring as hell. It's a good time to stream. Then Nintendo will make a horror game based off of this. Yo, did you hear about that horror game they're coming out with? A little snap one where it takes pictures and the ghost literally disappears or something like that? Taking Spoon 3 literally? I know. We got Spoon right here. Spoon 1. <laughs> All right, let's let's start adding these. I think they're opaque enough. I'm gonna start adding the chicken. The chicken should let off a little bit of juice to add more opaqueness to them, but yeah. Oh yeah. You need egg? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. We're gonna get eggs after. I didn't want to leave them out of the uh, out of the fridge for a while, you know. American eggs actually cannot stay in dry storage for that long. I know it's different in other countries, but in America, you can't do that, sadly. Honestly, they should bring back Pearl and Marina. They're probably the best duo because of how well they contrast. Yo, well, if you think about it, Fry and, uh, Fry and um, Shiver is like that, too. Big Man is just amazing. Adeline? <laughs> Don't worry. These, this chicken is like 70% lean. So we got, see, we got a little bit of it. <laughs> Oh, man. All right. Let's kind of let that kind of toast itself a little bit. <clears throat> in the meantime, in the meantime, I got to fill this, I got to fill this, uh, fill this rice, see if it's cooled off. Oh, yeah. It's cooled. It's cooled. It's ready. Oh, yeah. All right. Back, back to the chicken. Um, in the scrolls or wherever they say that Pearl Marina is doing rock music now, which is amazing. Well, I mean, Pearl has that rock voice, right? I'm pretty sure she got a rock voice. You can't convince me, Melody. I, I'm already... This is not ketchup. What do you mean that's not ketchup? I got ketchup. Don't worry. Maytag gets sponsorship of a lifetime. Yo, I know for real. <laughs> this stream is sponsored by Maytag. Not really, though. Not really. No. Don't believe that. I don't want... I don't, I don't want to be sponsored by somebody I don't really know. This isn't even our stove. This was here before we moved in. Okay, from now on, I will serve lean real meat. Now hook me up with some sweet and sour sauce. I don't have sweet and sour, but I do I do have some, some ketchup and I have some soy sauce. <laughs> Which one do you want? The idle intro, chef's kiss. Add some fart sauce. <laughs> I don't have any of that, but I do got some mixed veggies, you know? That'd be good. That's gonna go on this little stir fry of some sorts. Cause this is basically gonna be a stir fry. Or you know, like a fried rice and whatnot. Literally just making a chicken fried rice inside of egg, I think. That's what I'm, it doesn't have all the ingredients the same, but it has enough. In fact, one of the ingredients is actually milk. Do you have hot sauce? I do, I do. I don't use it very often. Uh, I'm not really a fan unless it's something like that, that would absolutely need hot sauce. Ah, stop being stuck. Ah, oh, that's stuck together. It's too late. Soy sauce and rice. Mm, I know, dude. I know. We don't. I don't actually have milk, uh, regular milk, because you know lactose. Uh, so I got this going on. I got some almond milk. Delicious stuff, by the way. It's a vanilla flavoring, so it's gonna make it taste really weird. But I'm ready for it. Is pink sauce still a thing? I think it is. I personally think it's still a thing. All right get these cooking again I'm like not even focusing on the food I'm glad you guys will let me know if anything burns okay y'all y'all are the alarm bells <laughs> I'm relying on every single one of you look how unseasoned this looks Ugh. I wish I would have been able to season it I wish it said to season it but I'm gonna trust the recipe I'm gonna trust that it knows what it's doing I'm really gonna trust it Pink sauce, yes, that's the good stuff right there. Wow, watch what some of y'all fathers never found, the milk. I know, for real, I had to go and find it myself, to be honest. 
Barbecue sauce? We have some of that too. I gotta start making some barbecue chicken or something like that. Barbecue sauce is so delicious. Hands down, guys. What's your favorite like condiment? Out of all the condiments in the world, what is it? It is also the creator of pink sauce. Got, <laughs> get, got in real trouble. Did she? Did she actually get in trouble? I, I know that there was like an ongoing thing between that, but I didn't know if there was like an outcome that it eventually came out of it and whatnot. I'm interested though. What happened? Woo! Uh, but mustard? Whoa! Okay, okay. Interesting choice. I can see that though. Mustard's not bad. I have to have it mixed with ketchup in order for me to like it. Hot sauce? Understandable completely. What kind of hot sauce though? What are we talking? To be honest, pink sauce? No, I tried it and it got sick from it. Did you actually? Oh my god. I wish. I wish I would have tried it. Low-key kind of still want to try it. But everybody is not doing well from it, so I'm not sure. Mad Dog 357. What kind of condiment is that? I'm watching in the middle of my English class and I'm hungry. Bruno, what are you doing, bro? You gotta pay attention. Soy sauce? I agree. Soy sauce is delicious. The FDA came down to her house because see, pink sauce was... Really? They actually traveled out there? I thought they would send a letter or something, a cease and desist, or I don't know, something like that. Mustard, ketchup, mayo bad. Yo, mayo is delicious. I don't know what you mean, but you're right. Ketchup is way better. Ketchup is 10 times better. I like soy sauce and A1 steak sauce. Ooh. Ooh, I love I love soy sauce, right? But I cannot do A1 steak sauce. Can't. I don't even like steak. Steak is so gross to me. I think it's because of how like chewy it is. Or I don't know. Like chicken, it's kind of soft, you know? It kind of reminds you of like like other foods. Steak straight up reminds you that you're eating an animal. You know what I mean? Ground beef is a lot easier to eat because it doesn't remind you of that. It's too soft and squishy. But like when you're eating a steak, it's like this is muscle. This is straight up muscle. It makes me uncomfortable. And it's also texture bad as well. So there's that as well. Mad Dog 357 is the spiciest hot sauce. Oh, I didn't even know about that. Any, I, I, I didn't even know about that, to be honest. Pink sauce has milk as an ingredient. Doesn't even... Yo, I know. I saw that. It's like, that's going to go bad. That's not... That's not, that's perishable, my dude. <laughs> Top Gun Maverick. Yo, what, what, what kind of sauce is that? I'm going to need more details, Ayo. Yeah, so basically when buying pink sauce, you're buying spoiled milk, basically, because it's already been out there. Unless it was like a dried, like, milk, you know? That that can at least be, like, non-perishable in some way. I'll eat any meat you throw at me except roast for some reason. Really? Roast is really... Isn't that one of the things you make, a chicken roast or something? Roast is really soft. Um, I don't like it because it's stringy, but... Satesh, me too. Me too. <laughs> like, you know... Look at this. This is going to take a while, man. Maybe I should turn up the heat a little bit. Whatever the case. It looks really good. I mean, the chicken looks so unseasoned, and it, it disgusts me, but, you know, it'll it'll get there. The new Zelda game is so polished, I just watched it in... Oh, that's sweet. Yo, yeah, they barely showed anything about the game. How do you, do you see anything? I wish that I, they would have showed a little bit more off from it. It makes me sad that they did not. I wanted a little bit more details on what the game was going to be, how the mechanics were going to work, but nonetheless, I am pretty hyped about it, regardless of whether or not they showed enough for it. I still wanted a little bit more, you know? I wanted a lot more, actually. I was I was hyped for it. I'm still hyped for it. I'm just, I just wish I would have got more details on what's going to happen. I do like that we got the name, though! Uh, Turi, IP, IP. What are you, what are you talking about, Rose? <laughs> Ali Hot... Revenant? Yeeha, re what is that? Is that like another sauce? Is, are you getting all these, are these sauces on the, uh, the, uh, celebrity hot sauce interviews or whatever? I love watching those. Those ones are fun. Seeing their mouths burn on there and <laughs> them not being able to answer questions is literally hilarious. I love that stuff. Uh, favorite subject in school, hands down for me, was probably, like, math. I love being able to, like, solve problems. It was fun. That's why I like going into computer science, too. Because that's the whole point of computer like coding and stuff. Solving problems and finding out equations. Anytime my dad makes barbecue... I, wait, what's your favorite subject, guys? What, do, what, what, do you, what would you say, Satesh? Anytime my dad would make barbecue, I would eat chicken thigh, hot dog, burger, and chicken leg. Like, all barbecue sauce, too? Or are they just, like, uh, 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 barbecue grilled? I know, but at least we have the real release date yeah that's true 
they don't want to leak much stuff. I think it's going to be exciting. I think they're going to come out with a lot of stuff for that game. I think it's going to be as legendary as Breath of the Wild was. Nintendo actually added an NPC that said that he sees the land and the sky. What do you mean? Like, 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 uh, kind of like Cass? My favorite subject to sleep? Amen to that. Math, biology, and agriculture science? Is that what it is? Agriculture? Agriculture is cool. It's always nice to learn this stuff. PE and social studies. Social studies is good. I, I'm taking a history class right now for college. I'm hoping to get my history class over with so I can get into computer stuff. Uh, but yeah, what are you guys looking to get like a, a degree in, or if you guys are looking for like a degree? It's all good if you're not. Not everyone's goal is to get a degree. Mine for sure wasn't at the beginning of like, at the end of high school and stuff. So I completely understand from both point of views on like where you'd want to go with that kind of stuff and whatnot. You're still raw. Cook more. Cook more. Uh, I don't like how raw it looks. How do people like French? I can barely speak Spanish and Portuguese. Yo, French is, oh, I love French and art. Art is great, I loved art. French is interesting though, cause they kind of sound like they're angry half the time. Not as angry as German, but for sure. Unknown recipe, but who did get burned? You have no feeling it's fried chicken mix with different 20 hot sauce. Oh, what? Like, what do you, what do you mean? Like that's a recipe somebody puts or what? Bachelor's in graphic design and in fashion design. Ooh, what are you looking to do? I'm in on your arm. Ayo, where? Ayo. <laughs> I'm doing French and Spanish. I'm getting and I'm getting confused. Yo, Spanish is hard. I think. Well, actually, English is hard. It's hard to translate English to Spanish because of how much different words we use for a single word. You know. Oh, didn't. didn't I don't know what you mean by didn't, though. I don't, I don't know how that applies. Alibor Bigsby, welcome! I speak Portuguese? Hey, nice! I like how Portuguese is kind of like, uh... Kind of like, uh, uh, Spanish in a way, you know? Like, it's it's close enough, but it's far. It's far from what it is. It's kind of interesting seeing how those languages collide in, in a sort of way. How, like, when, when uh, colonizers came to the Americas and stuff, and they kind of split up there. Like, you know, the Portugal went down to, like, South America while um, the Spanish went to Central America and how the languages differed there. French went up to Canada and that's why they speak French today. It's kind of wild how that happened and stuff like that. My French is rusty, but I still love it. All I know how to say is wee oui, wee. Oui. That's all I know. Wee oui, wee. Oui. <laughs> the burn makes real fire? Wait, for, like, a hot sauce? Do they burn stuff to make it, like, spicier or what do you mean? Oh, Shapes and Beats? I actually have an old video on that, honestly. I used to do videos on that. Dude, that game makes me so upset, though, because I suck at it. I am terrible at that game. Ugh. All right, now we're adding the, the mixed veggies. Let's see how much we need. We're going to need about a cup of mixed veggies. So Let's go. A cup of mixed veggies. I might add, add a little bit over, just to kind of get a feel. Bam! Look at all those greens. That's good stuff right there. I'm going to refreeze this real quick. Hold up. Alright. Now let's get this mixed up real quick. <clears throat> It's on Switch and PC, I think? Oh, oh, I know it's free. I knew that. It's on mobile mostly that I played it on, at least, but. Look at how good this looks now, man. Now you know what we gotta do. We gotta give it a little seasoning. I even sing in French. Ooh, nice. You know that much? Do you know how to cook wontons? I've never tried, but I guarantee I could. I could cook wontons. All right, let's salt this baddie up. There we go. We got a lot of chicken in there, so. I know this might be a little salty, but I'd rather it be salty than unflavored at all. Uh, I beat the game? Wait, wait, wait. You... Tamadachi life? Oh, God. I didn't even know the, the, the port the port came out yet, honestly. Bonjour! <laughs> I didn't know the port came out for that yet. 
Will you ever play Portal? Please do if you haven't. I have played Portal. I actually have a video on Portal too if you want to check that out. I, it might be on my channel still. If it's not, I'll look back and see if I can find it. It's definitely still there somewhere. Uh, the times I will speak French. Oh, sorry. Let me just make sure I get enough on there. Speak French is when I'm singing French song. I don't know the lyrics though. Feel honored that my French teacher passed me by one point for French and pass the other 14 subjects. Well, you know, it's hard. It's hard to, whew, it's hard to pass all your subjects, you know, because you're doing so many classes in college and, and in, in high school in general that, like, it's hard to retain all that information. They need to slow it down a little bit, you know, and give you time to actually soak in some of that information. Look at that. Look at how good it looks now. I don't know if I flavored it enough, but we'll, we'll see when I get to tasting. I don't speak French? Yo, I don't speak French at all either. French is mid? What do you mean? French is cool. Have you ever played Tomodachi Life? I actually never have. Um, I'm interested in it, and I wanted to play it. I think I got a little bit of playthrough for it, but not, not enough to like form an opinion on it. But I can't read music even to save my life. Yo, that's one of the important skills too, because music is fun. I can't read music that well. But I definitely used to be able to. I don't remember anything that I used to like, learn. Let me try. Dang, that's delicious. That's pretty good. I might do a little bit more salt, though. Just to kind of... There we go. Always taste your food. Play it now? Yo! <laughs> I, w I would, but maybe. I got to... Gotta go see you. Probably come on later if you're still live. Yeah, for sure, man. I'll be late. I'll be live later on for like an or uh, Splatoon. They're Japanese o o OST from Digimon. Yo, Digimon is so good though. Burns mouth. How'd you do that, fail? Or you mean me? Because I, I I ate. I tried it. It's actually not as hot as you think it would be. Because I have it on like a medium low setting. It's enough to cook it, but not enough to like burn my mouth. It probably would be if I cooked it a little bit longer, too. Look at how colorful it looks. It looks so good. <clears throat> Damn, that looks good. I know, dude. Yo, send me some food. Yo, I will. Look at that. Look at how good that looks. It looks delicious, man. It looks even greener. Like, you, you're seeing it on stream. It looks, like, kind of, kind of, you know, weird and flat. But, like, if you see it in real life, it's colorful. It's really colorful. All right, all right. Now we got the cooled rice. One eight hundred send food now. I'll send it. My, I'll send it your way. Don't worry. Dang, you're making me hungry, dude. I I hope so, cause I'm hungry too. Now we're adding some of this rice in. Damn, look at all that. Kind of pull out some more. That's a lot of rice. I knew it wasn't gonna be able to fit. I knew it wasn't gonna fit, but we're we're using it anyway. Cool. This is cooled down rice. So you don't want to uh, put like warmed up or warmed rice on there to cook as well because what will happen with your rice is your rice will actually soften up a lot too. So it's not a good idea to do that. Ooh, look at that, man. Even more colors. Love it. That's how you know a dish is good is it have, if it has those beautiful colors. I'm like spilling all the food all around the stove. I'm on the pan eating the food. Oh no, dude. It's probably delicious, isn't it? Oh no, I'm being drowned in rice. You shouldn't have gone on the food, bro. I knew it was going to happen. From 1 to 10, how hard it was it to cook? I've never cooked before. Um, if I'm going to be honest with you, it, it's probably like a, a 1. Maybe a 2 to get used to like uh, heat and stuff like that. But really, it's not hard. You All it is is following directions. So if you already went through like, I'd say four grades of school in general, I think you'd be able to cook no matter who you are. It's really easy. I never went to college for cooking. Uh, I actually learned on my job site. So that was like one of the things that I got. I'm not the best cook, but it's really easy. There's some food that takes skill, but like these ones don't. Melody becomes more hungry. Yeah, she probably could smell it it's like hella. <laughs> Don't worry, after rice, Rose, yeah, eat your way out of it. Because I ain't getting you out. I'm burning it out. I'm under the rice, touching the pan. Yo, that's probably hot, too. By now, it should be, like, a little bit of scalding. 
Oh, look at that, man. Delicious. All right. All right, what next? Add ketchup and soy sauce and stir to combine. So how much ketchup and soy sauce are we talking here? So we need at least um, one tablespoon of ketchup and one tablespoon of soy sauce. So I, I'm not actually going, going to uh, measure it out. It's actually two teaspoons of soy sauce. So I'd say about right there is fine. And then of ketchup, I'm gonna do like, it's two tablespoons. So we're gonna do one tablespoon and two tablespoons. And I'd say that's about right for what we're gonna do here. I know it's weird to put ketchup in here, but that's what the recipe calls for, so we're gonna use it. And I know that's weird, but I'm telling you, ketchup is a really good thing to put in. Otherwise, you would have to add like your own tomato paste or something like that, and vinegar and all that. And it's like, there's no point if you already have some, some ketchup with you, you know? It's like, it makes more sense that you just add it in there. I actually might have to use a spatula for this, honestly. It's starting to get harder to mix. But yeah, and the ketchup is a good mixture of all that, those flavors and whatnot. You get all of them in one instead of having to like slowly mix them in and whatnot. I think that's a genius way of cooking your food. Oh man, look at that though, dude. Look at that. Not the ketchup, bro. It's good, trust me, it's so good. Oh man. I know it doesn't sound good, but you gotta you gotta trust it here. Ketchup is a good mix. Like everybody thinks it's taboo to add that, but it, it it doesn't make sense to me. Like why wouldn't you, you know? There we go. Look at that. Look at all that looks. Alright, let's kinda smooth it up. All right, so we got add and stir. Transfer the fried rice to a plate and wash the pan. Okay, so now I'm gonna transfer this, actually not to a plate, because as much as I want to, this is not gonna fit a plate. It's not gonna fit a plate at all. Uh, so I'm actually gonna use a, this. Because at least I think it'll fit. He's dead, oh no. <laughs> I'm probably the youngest person in the chat. How old are you? This is Priyakra, sadly, she has died. I'm taking her place. Well, I'm glad that uh, she found somebody that would be able to take her place. All right, look at that. Look at that, perfect, smooth and out. All right, they also want me to wash off the uh, pan and everything. I don't think it's necessary, but I'll give it like a pat down for sure. Damn, okay. Let's kind of move this out of the way. Right here. Let's bring the heat down a little bit. I'm gonna mix some more of this rice. I wanna give it a taste before I do anything else because it looks good. Oh, it's good. It's good stuff. I'm even more excited. My man Shirley knows how to make a meal worth it. Worthy of a king? I know. And a queen. Oh snap, Werb is actually younger than you! <laughs> I'm 24, yo, me too. 23, gang. Hold on, let me uh, see, what's next? So we did that. Um, our next goal is to make the Oma rice at one time. Whisk one egg and one tablespoon of milk in a small bowl. I could just use this one. So, let's get a whisk. And I'm gonna go get eggs. Right, I got my eggs. So it makes it makes you want to make it one time. Interesting, interesting. I mean, I'll do it, but we're of course same. Oh, you guys are all the same age. Can I make you have slight anxiety? Let's hear it. How you do it? How you gonna do it? <laughs> Bruno, we did not talk about you. Oh yeah, we don't talk about Bruno. That's right. <laughs> Well, I'm old then. Well, we're older than you, so, I mean, you're right in the middle. We are closer to 2040 than 2000. True that, my dude. It's crazy. It's crazy seeing that, too. All right. Let's put some egg in there. It only wants one egg. 
And then with one ta tablespoon of milk, how much eggs does it ask for? Two large eggs? Okay. Let's see. Tablespoon. I'm going to actually follow the recipe on this one. One egg and one tablespoon of milk in a small bowl. There we go. And this had freaking chicken on it, so I better put this in the sink. You don't want to. You don't want to mix all that stuff. Woo me exactly, dude. Exactly. Woo. Let me put the stove on low. October is my B day. That's why I gotta wait till the 28th to get flat. Yo, October is my B day too. What day? What day exactly? Anyone thinking me, kid, but I'm just raging and being mad? Why are you raging, bro? <laughs> OG no spam. It ain't too bad, I mean. All right, 28, there we go. We got our egg and milk, you just give it a good mix. All right. Uh, oh, my B-Day ends this out. Oh, I thought, oh, yours is on the 28th, nice, man. Mine's uh, on the 13th, so. Man, the plot of this show surely is chickening, for real. <laughs> It's chicken in for sure. All right, we got the egg mixed up. It kind of just looks like yolk, you know? All right, let me just kind of put this over here. All right, so then we heat one tablespoon of oil. So let's put the heat back up a little bit. We're gonna get some olive oil, I think it was. I do olive oil, maybe like a personal infill. Now give it my birthday? Ah, no problem. Don't have to. There we go. Uh, call me calamari instead of okuro since I'm cooked. Yeah, don't get cooked. Stay off the hook. You know, I kind of understand that now. Kind of understand that a little bit more than I did before. All right. So we kind of oil it up again. Give it a nice little coat. Uh, when the pan is hot, pour in egg mixture and tilt the pan to coat the entire surface. So yeah, literally just do this. And then you kind of like pour it around, you know, make sure it goes around. Woo. There we go. Trying to make sure that it cooks off a little bit around it. Ah, I should have waited till it was like warmed up a little bit more. It definitely wasn't warmed up all the way. <laughs> Come on, mix, mix. There we go. I think that'll be fine. That'll be okay. Me trying to remember the names of some chicken in Animal Crossing? Yo, what's his name? Uh, ah, dang. He's the one in the armor, remember? The one in the gold armor? Killed the children for real? Also, Octo Rose is alive? Actually dead, never mind. They're just back and forth, right? Have you cooked other Animal Crossing food before? No, but we will be for the next few days. So there's that. Let's kind of move this back a little bit. Look at how good that looks. All right, when the pan is hot, pour egg mixture, pan the coat, sprinkle three tablespoons of cheese on top. Okay. Okay, three tablespoons, so let's say like around that is one, that is two, and that is three. Kind of like sew it off a little bit. There we go. All right, and then we'll add just a little bit of this. Ah! Dang, 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 stay on. Okay, there's that. <clears throat> Sprinkle a cheese on top, then add half the ketchup fried rice crust, the middle of the omelet. Uh, use a spatula to fold both sides of the omelet over the middle and cover the fried rice. Carefully move the omelet rice to the edge of the pan. Okay, easy. So then we use this to kind of cover. Rice. Oh, carefully, carefully square. Oh no, I don't think I had enough egg. <laughs> oh god. 
Yeah, I don't think I had enough egg. Hold on. Let's see. I think I put too much rice in it, probably. I definitely did. I definitely put too much rice. Let's see if I can remove some of it. Okay. Ah, oh, dang it. Random Square is not as careful as I thought I was. Careful, SpongeBob. Nope. <laughs> I didn't make it big enough. Dang it, man. That's okay. Woo! Spicy. There we go. There we go. I think I covered it up enough. So we can cover up the rice a little bit. Alright. Then uh, use the spatula form as the pan. Um, hold in the plate in one hand and the pan in the other. Flip the pan? How am I supposed to flip? Okay, okay, okay. This is gonna be really hard, chat. I won't order food today? <laughs> Bro, I'm the egg? Nice. Alright, alright, alright. This is the stream. This is the stream. It certainly is. Okay. This is gonna be the hard part of this. So, bear with me, guys. Bear with me a little bit. Alright. Come on. So, let me see if I can get this up. And kind of, I don't know how I'm gonna do this exactly. Let's see. Oh! Oh! We did it! Look at that! Look at that, guys! <laughs> oh no! I mean, it's kind of like overfolding and everything, but you know, look at that! Hold on. Let's bring this over here. So while it's still hot, cover the omelet rice with the paper towel to form. Okay, plate. While it's still hot, get paper towels. Cover the omelet rice with the paper and form it with your hands in a long lane, elongated, similar to an American football. Okay. Okay. So there's that, right? That one's done. We're gonna do another one real quick. Uh, it's going to be my Chipotle burrito again. Yeah, but you're supposed to eat this one with a fork. You're not supposed to eat it with your hands. I'm so proud of you, my guy. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you, Scott. I appreciate it, man. <laughs> All right, let's get on to our second one. Now I kind of got an idea on what we're doing. So Melody orders fast food. Hey, yo, don't even. Don't even. Like, it came out really good. <laughs> we're going to do it again, too. We're going to do it again. We're going to have a good one. So let's kind of spread this around. Make sure we get it going. And then we get the milk again. A tablespoon of milk and then an egg. That was pretty good, guys. I don't know what you're talking about. That was pretty good. We'll, we'll form it here in a second once I made another one. All right. There we go. And then another egg. Yo, I hope... I hope the Japanese fe like viewers that I got are proud of me. Mushroom skewer? You're making me want to, low-key. Your dad came back with the milk? Yeah, he did. I'm thankful for him coming back finally after all those years. <laughs> there we go. Some egg. All right. Let's mix this baddie up. Oh, spilled some. Perfect. Perfect, man. I think. Maybe I should... That looks fine. It looks okay. Woo! Okay. Animal Crossing Omoris. I think it's, that's what it's called. I'm gonna pretend everything you just said ain't real. <laughs> it happened. Oh, yeah. Are you making another one? Yeah, one for me, one for my wife. So, let's go. Let's do this. Let's kind of bring 
some down here. All right, that looks about, eh, you know, it's not a circle, but it's something. Two eggs at a time, right? Random has a wife? Yeah, yeah, I do. Knox cries. <laughs> okay. Let's make sure that like toasts a little bit, just so I can make sure it's all fine. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna roll it down the middle this time, as opposed to what I did last time, which was spread it all around. And I'm gonna do the same with the other one, the uh, the actual stuff in the middle. My brother gave me Splatoon 3 story spoiler. Now I'm sad. Yo, I hope I hope I don't get the spoiler. I I, I really want to go through the game the, the the game fine, you know. I personally love rice. Yo, rice is so good. I love rice too. What if you were to burn it? What would Gru do? What would Gru do? I don't know. That's a question for you, fam. All right, back to it. There's one scoop, and I'm gonna do another scoop down here. Bam. This one actually got no chicken in it, so I'm gonna add some chicken pieces. Just, just a few little pieces, just to kind of show it off. All right. And now that we got those chicken pieces in. Let's kind of wrap this baddie up in like a little blanket. All right, hold on, hold on. Let's wrap this buddy, wrap this buddy up. Let's bring him over here. There we go. Ooh. Okay. And then wrap the top part up. Over, over, over. God, man, this is this is difficult. I might have overfilled it again. Woohoo! What a buoy! What a buoy! I, I overfilled it again. I, I did. I made the same mistake that I was swore not to do again. It's such an easy mistake not to make again, but I did it. Ah, no! Get back up there! And get back down there! Perfect. Okay, not perfect, but, you know, we're making moves. We're getting a little bit closer to what it, what, what it should be. Okay, we're good, we're good. I think that's close enough. Let's get another plate and call this one good. All right. Back down to low. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta, I gotta figure out a better way to do this. Ah, uh, let me see. I got it! I got it! <laughs> to all the haters that say it's fake, to all the haters that'll say it's fake, look at that! All right, let's see. And then I'm pretty sure that's it. I just gotta do a little bit. All right, that's it guys. Let's see, let's see. Okay, we got two little omelets. One looks a lot better than the other one, but you know, holy crap. How Melody and Random met story. <laughs> High school basically. Uh, she didn't love me and I liked her, so. Um, random has achieved an achievement. Touch hot pan. I did. I'm always burning my hands, to be honest. All right, bro, working in the kitchen? Heck yeah, man. So let's get this a little mix. And the final thing to do with the Omi ri ri rice thingy is you kind of give it a little drizzle at the top. There we go. I messed that one up, but that's okay. Okay. There we go. Hold on, hold on. Bam, bam. Let me go give this one to Melody, but look at that. Look at that, man. Look at how good that looks. Oh my God, man. The first one came out perfect. Bye guys, gotta do homework. All right, word, thanks for coming out. Catch him, I'm out, bro. That's how it's made. Okay, hold on. Let me uh, get a good picture of this real quick, because I got a log. Here we go. Swipe to unlock. Let's see if I can get the picture going. Okay, there we go. Hold on, hold on, hold on. 
Let me kind of get all this stuff out in the back. There we go. And next thing you kind of want to do is kind of show off the inside, you know? Kind of show off the inside of it spilling out just a little bit. You know, kind of kind of show off the insides. Bam! Look at how good that looks. That looks delicious, bro. <sighs> Y'all say ketchup not good right now, but guarantee it's gonna be delicious. Guarantee. Skeptical? Yo, eggs and ketchup mixes so well. I don't know what you guys are talking about. The ketchup doesn't look right over the video. <laughs> the lighting makes it look like pink sauce? Yo, it's not, I promise. I don't know how to show off that it's not, but it totally is red, I swear. All right, the final test. Final test, chat. Oh, that's not pink sauce? No, it's not, I promise. Um, the, the kitchen lighting definitely looks weird. Well, let me see, let me see if I can fix it up a little bit, hold on. Um, do I have flash on this? I don't even have flash on my head, I don't know. Um, let's see. It's my fork! No! Okay, but like, listen, listen, hear me out, hear me out, right? I might have made way too much. I might have way made way too much. Look at this. This is the leftovers. That's a lot. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. I mean, it's technically a fried rice, so I guess not bad. All right, time to test out this food real quick. Let's hear it, guys, let's hear it. Let me just move this down a little bit. Boom. Okay. All right, all right. Let's kind of angle this down a little bit. Ooh. I think I put this up way too high, honestly. But yeah, okay. So we got the food. We got, we got this going. It's time to actually give it a good try now. I swear this is gonna be delicious. I know you guys doubt that the it's gonna taste good. Ship it to me. <laughs> Give away extras. Literally, the intense anticipation of you tasting it is ridiculous right now. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if it's gonna be delicious, but the ketchup definitely. It, 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 it's gonna be good. It's not too bad. Good, good, good. All right, all right. Look at all that. Look at all that flavorings there. That's so weird. Hey y'all, what's up, Lincoln? Melody with the spoiler. I know, how dare. It's good. I like it. I think the ketchup was a good idea. It actually makes it taste even better. Why is it <laughs> excited to see random eat food? Because I made it. I made Omi Reese. O Omi, Omi Re Re I don't know what it's called. Hold on, hold on. Let me see. Omi Risu. The ketchup pulls it all together. Yeah, exactly. It tastes good. It's delicious, man. Hold on. Let me see if I can pull up a picture of what Omi Risu looks like normally. Because I think the problem is, you guys are seeing it like this. It does not look like this normally. I don't think it does. Let's see if I can pull up my uh, Omu Rice. Oh, it was Omo Rice. Omo Rice. I'm jealous right now. Take some. <laughs> Hey, if you want some, come pick it up and I'll give you some. I could probably go without the meat though. That's just meat. Yeah, chicken. Chicken's delicious though. Hold on, so I'll show you. This is a picture from Google about Omi Riku. I don't know if I can show it exactly, but. I think the truth, if I would have used two eggs, it probably would have been way better. So that that's what it's supposed to look like. And honestly, I think it's pretty close. Like, look at this. Look at that. It looks pretty dang close. It's smaller, but it was for the greater good, man. <laughs> it was low-key poggers. It was for sure low-key poggers. I'm sorry, y'all. Y'all are missing out. <laughs> Random pulls out a bottle of water. Literally everyone gasped in <laughs> I hope so. I hope so. That'd be awesome. 
random shit me and slice. Honestly, it's so good. I'm so glad I made this. <laughs> Animal Crossing pulls it off again, man. Pulls it off. Next recipe is hot remnants. <laughs> you could say this was a random stream. Not funny. Nah, that was hilarious, my dude. Next one. Actually, tomorrow we're going to do another cooking stream. So don't worry, fam. We got you. Um, it's going to be something called pumpkin... Pumpkin Noki. Noki... Noki Day something. I don't remember, but it's going to be so good. I promise. It, it looks good. No, next random we're roasting sherb. Oh, yeah. Next is sherb. My piece is officially going to last. Take a break. <laughs> I'll probably make two more slices of it off stream, but... <clears throat> I'd say, guys, if you get a chance, Omi Rice is... O Omu Rice or whatever is actually officially good. Hmm. What about mushrooms? I gotta do that soon. I gotta figure out a time where I can do that. Cook calamari? Mm. If I could, if I'm, I don't know if I can do seafood. <laughs> I'm bad at just this. But next time, guys, um, I'm gonna be streaming later on. Meet me for some Splatoon 3 later on today. I'm gonna be cooking again tomorrow. Don't worry. We're gonna be doing, uh, what is it? Uh, uh, uh Pumpkin de Noki something. I don't even know. But be there for it, guys. It's going to be good. It's going to be more like a, a, a sweet kind of food. Uh, give us the words. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. You know what? I forgot to say right here. Um, I give this meal right here, right? I give it a good 11 out of, out of, out of 15. I know that's a weird scoring, but that's what I'm giving it. It's pretty good. Out of, out of 10, actually. Let's see. I give it an 8 out of 10. It's really good. I love ketchup and eggs, so that's perfect already. But it, it's got to have more inside of it. I think I gotta, I gotta like not get off the recipe and make my own calamari with just paint thinner. Oh no! Trying to get no spoilers. Will it be story? It will not be story. Today is not a story day. I'm going to be doing salmon runs, so and a little bit of a, a turf and whatnot. So join me, guys. Series of cooking food from every continent. Ooh, that would be fun. That'd be really fun. For the next three days, it's going to be Animal Crossing specifically, but I would totally do that. We got to plan something for that because pretty good. It's a good meal, but it's not something I'd crave, so I give it a 7 out of 10. Fair, fair. When? Tomorrow, same time as today, like around 2 p.m. MST, 3 p.m. MST, I don't know, somewhere around there. But yeah, join me next stream, guys. I, I would love to like do more. Uh, at, uh, some We're going to do more uh, uh, Splatoon later on today after I'm done eating, obviously, but yeah. Feel free to like, feel free to join me on that tomorrow and also, or, or, or tonight and also tomorrow, we're gonna be doing a cooking stream and also Splatoon again. So join me on that. Thank you all for coming out. It was nice having you guys. Uh, have a good night. Do not let the bed bugs bite and have a great morning. If it's morning, I'll see you guys later. <laughs> Give us the words. What are the words? What are the words? Put on words on stream? I can't, I'm streaming from my phone. Yeah. I, I will do words when we get to streaming later on today, but I promise we'll, we'll get to that. <laughs> Thanks guys for coming. Words, I can't do words. <laughs> I'm streaming on my phone. I can't, I'm sorry. How about this? I'll go to, uh, I don't know, man. You guys can wait. Get out of here. Words later for sure.